dear all welcome to the playlist of demand side management in this video i'll be discussing dsm techniques you know in the previous video we have discussed the dsm technique up to tariff intervention okay so we have there are 11 checklists in that we have completed the nine checklist i request you to watch my previous video to get clarified about the concept up to nine in this video i am going to discuss the remaining two techniques such as different time zones and rain water harvesting what do you mean by maintaining different time zones yes of course you need to know that uh, it is always better to use the load better to operate the load during peak hours off peak hours don't operate the load during peak hours it is always shift the load from peak hours to off peak hours so if you operate the load during peak hours there are lot of drawbacks number one energy efficiency is very less during peak hours then cost per unit will be very much high and also whatever the equipments you are going to use during peak hours definitely that spoils the quality of equipments and also the power which is delivering by the utility company providing by the utility company there are lot of power quality issue during peak hours so it is always better to shift the load from peak hours to off peak hours so i'll be writing one point please note down okay load will load should be uh, shifted from peak hours peak hours to off peak hours off peak hours okay off peak so peak hours to off peak hours the load shifting should be done from peak hours to off peak hours so try to use for example uh, you need to suppose you are doing the water pumping application better operate the pump set during off peak hours so morning time we can able to fill the water and uh, evening time we can make use of that okay don't try to operate the equipments during peak hours so that you can able to customer regarding the customer point of view they can minimize the electricity bill okay that is a great thing regarding the utility company side they can able to provide the high quality of power that is another point and also the equipment efficiency also will be improved if you are following if the customer following in this manner ultimately customer has very important role in maintaining different time zone okay so uh, suppose utility can decide if the customer uses the electricity during peak hours the pen penalty can be uh, given to the customer or customer will be penalized like this they can able to frame a new policy so this is regarding uh, maintaining different time zones so this is one of the dsm technique important dsm technique another important dsm technique is rain water harvest this can be done with the help of different civil engineering techniques anyway water what are the essentials of water you know without water uh, we cannot able to run an industry or we cannot move ahead 100 percentage how do you produce electricity without water so whether uh, hydroelectric power station work without water never it is never be possible so water is an ultimate sources of energy we can able to save so try to make the water saving as much as possible during rainy season the bulk amount of water will be Uh, dissolved in different areas so we need to store the particular water for that purpose you need to follow with the uh, rain water harvesting technique okay there are different civil engineering techniques to save the water by using uh, the rain water harvesting technique okay engineering works can be implemented to save the water so rain water harvesting it is a broadest sense it is a technology used for collecting and storing rain water for the human use from rooftop land surfaces rock catchments using a simple technique such as jars and pots as well as different engineering techniques so government can able to make a rule such that rain water harvesting is must for a newly constructing buildings if such rules uh, prevail definitely uh, it helps a lot for the customer point as well as utility point okay so water can be able to store new application of appropriate rain water harvesting technology is important for the utilization of rain water as a water resource definitely water need to be stored 
So, uh, this is uh, one of the best solution for energy crisis also. So, in this session, uh, we have uh, pointed out the nine important techniques uh, for the DSM techniques, which I already covered in the previous session. And the remaining two techniques I have highlighted, especially what is a different maintaining different time zones and uh, rainwater harvesting. I hope you understood the session. Uh, let me know if you are having any clarification. I request you to uh, put down uh, some important questions in the comment box so that I can able to reply. I am very happy to reply for your question. And also one of uh, one of my uh, viewer, one of my audience uh, requested to maintain some requested me to put up some problems related to demand side management. I am going to frame those numerical example very soon and uh, revert you as soon as possible. So may I know any more uh, clarification? I hope you are doing well. Thank you very much for watching this video.